The one is Sam Mann's Impact, owned and trained by Ronald Gellerman of Sardinia, Ohio, with Jeff Ace Nysonger. Number two is Noble Mert, owned by Matt Heyman of Circleville, Ohio, trained by Jim Artlich with Brett Miller. Number three is Hidden Affair, owned by Thomas Moore of Richwood, Ohio, trained and driven by Don Feaster. The four is Terramina, owned and trained by Jeffrey Dennis of Wilmington, Ohio. Jeff Fount is up. The five is Special Pass, owned by Paver of Marysville, Ohio, and Paver and Paver of Raymond, Ohio, trained by Joe Paver, Kyle Ader. Number six is Sparkling Sampra, owned by George Irvin, Adelphus, Ohio, trained by Dan Wiseman with Dallas Miller. Number seven is Ms. Baker Lady, owned by Honor Collier of Vandalia, Ohio, trained by Forrest Collier with Jim Daly. The eight, Rita's Velvet is out lame. From the outside of the nine is Bam, she's out. Owned and trained by Charlie Park of Xenia, Ohio, Justin Hall is up and scoring from off the second tier is the 10, Good Time Ali. Owned, trained and driven by Bucky Trout of Washington Courthouse, Ohio, he is in her sulky. Stretch for the nightcap. Field in motion being sent on their way. They're off fan pacing and firing out for the lead. Middle of the track, there goes the four. Terra Mina, she's pointed for command. From the outside, there is Sparkling Samra driving up from the rail. There is Sandman's Impact to come away in third. Fourth is Hidden Affair along the inside in five is Special Pass. A gap of two and a half in six. That is Noble Mert along the inside in seventh is Good Time Ali. Eighth on the inside is Ms. Baker Lady in ninth and trailing the field. That is Bam, she's out. As they move by the opening quarter, the opening quarter came and went in 28 and two fifths. They'll pass the stands for the first time and head on down to the half. On top of the field, that is Terramina and Jeff Fount leading it here by a length and a quarter. At the inside, Sam Mann's impact. She's used the rail to her advantage. Come away racing in two. On the inside, Hidden Fair is racing in third and now rushing up on the outside. That is Sparkling Sabra. Way back there, off stride was good time only as they bank around the clubhouse turn in the finale. On top of the field, Terramina leads it here by a length and a half. Up on the outside, Racing in second, that is Sparkling Sabra. They trip the halfway mile beam of the race in 59 and one fifth. Off the turn and driving down the backside in the finale. Heads are pointed towards three quarters and on top. Terramina leads it here by a widening length and three quarters. And to the outside, Sparkling Sabra is beginning to labor just a bit on the outside in two. Sam Mann's impact could not go with her in third. Swung up three wide of the outside. Here comes Hidden Affair and Hidden Affair is on the go as they track down the backside approaching the three quarter mile mark of the race. Three quarters on the board and one. 127 and three fifths. And on top of the field, Terramina, Hidden Affair. The two heavyweights are colliding here as they race around the final turn. Terramina with the lead. And to the outside, Hidden Affair is still right at her neck, racing in two. Less than an eighth of a mile to go. And down the stretch they come. Terramina is being put to the test. Hidden Affair strikes the frontier. Hidden Affair is going on and going strong. Hidden Affair in front. Finishing second was the four, Terramina. Third was the five, Special Pass. Fourth was the one, Sandman's Impact to round out the Super. 156, two fives, Hidden Affair. Side of the winner's circle, the unofficial winner of the 10th and final, number three, Hidden Affair. A five-year-old bay mare by Sandman Hanover out of a noble bu bunny mare, she by Noble Land Sam. Owned by Thomas Morrow of Richwood, Ohio. Nicely trained and driven by Don Feaster. Posting the third win in 2003, 156 and two, the three, Hidden Affair. Late pick three, three of three, 629.20.